Hey everyone, today I have two activities for you geared towards younger children that will help them work on their numbers and counting. So the first one is the Choo Choo Color Train and it comes with five train cars and each one is filled with a different color and number and shape inside. So for example, the purple one has the number five and then there's five square blocks on the inside. The number four blue cart has four rectangular blocks on the inside. Number three has three cylindrical shapes on the inside. The orange number two has two triangular shapes. And the red number one has the train engineer on the inside. So as you can see, the train can be a simple toy that young kids can play with. And it can also be a learning tool. So for example, where's the number five? You would have them find the number five. You can also take out all of the shapes. And mix them all up. And figure out where they go. So we know this is blue, so they could match by color. But they can also count where are the four blue shapes. One, two, three, four. And continue for the rest of the shapes. Another game that you can play with the Choo Choo Color Train is finding other items to place in the cars that match the correct color. So for example, this strawberry is red, so I'm going to put it in here. I have an orange alligator, so I'll put it in the orange cart. I have a green acorn. I have a blue cube, and I have a purple cupcake. You could do something similar with the numbers. So I have these little muffins here, and I'm going to count one, two, three, four, five, and put five muffins in there. The next product that young kids can practice their numbers with is the Smart Snacks Number Pops, and they are colored popsicles each with numbers on them, and then the colored part slides off, and underneath the popsicle has the same color, and then the number of dots below. One thing you can do with the Smart Snacks Number Pops is open all of the popsicles and shuffle them around, and then kids can match the number to the dots. So this has five purple dots, so I would find the number five, and I would put it together, and then put it off to the side. Finally, there's a free resource on the Learning Resources website called Learn About Numbers, where students can go through the activity book and practice tracing and writing their numbers. They can also practice counting. There's lots of pictures of animals. For example, there are six chickens, and there are 10 cows, and they can practice all of these same skills with this activity book. Thanks for checking out these Learning Resources products. Whenever you get a chance, head over to the Learning Resources website where you can check out the other great activities they have for their Numbers Week. Thanks!